Somebody touched a mouse baguette? This is the gastro series. It sounds awful, but gastronomy, I think, or gastrology. Gastronomy is like the study of food in a scientific sense. So it's not about gastrointestinal stuff. I guess it kind of is, but isn't. Anyway, we've got the specially selected spaghetti carbonara today. Cooked spaghetti in a rich and creamy and cheesy sauce with smoked pancetta and topped with parmigiano reggiano. No mushrooms in this one. Not all of them have them, I guess. So serves one. This is about 3.20. I got this for slightly less because it was on offer. Yep. Yeah, that's a lot of fat in there. I suppose it is a full meal, so quite a creamy dish as well. So there we are. Obviously mostly pasta, obviously. And it's an Audi thing, obviously. Right, I have managed to scorch the edges of this. I'm just going to a bit of a wake up, you stupid pasta. It's a bit hot. Right, I've always struggled with pasta, with the spaghetti specifically. Right. Mmm, mmm. Very creamy. I'm also now starting to see the point of spaghetti. So, in you doing all of this, twiddling about nonsense, you cool it down. Ever so slightly. By whipping the pasta around. Right, so a bit of this pancetteriness. Mmm. Mmm. Oh my goodness. Oh wow. Oh. Nice and put some pancetta. Mmm. Mmm. Mm. That is beautiful. <clears throat> now, would I spend around 320 on this if I wasn't buying this on offer? Honestly? Yeah. It's an occasional treat. Yeah, I think you could do a lot worse than this, actually. Okay, it's not quite restaurant tier. You know, the pasta's a little bit too soft, but. Could be because I put it in slightly too long. Mm. But overall, for a refrigerated ready meal, that's really good. <clears throat> no notes. Mm. Yes, I think 9.5 out of 10. I would give it an absolute 10 if it weren't a little bit, you know, less finicky on the pasta. This isn't one of those things where, it's one of those things where if you overcook it even slightly, you get slightly um, too soft pasta. And pasta's got to be out then too. To be perfect. You know, it's got to have a little bit of bite. Hence the name. Hence the word. To the tooth, as it were. Everything else, completely solid. Well done, Aldi. Alright, thank you for tuning in. I'm going to finish this off now. But leave your comments below and your suggestions of what I should try next. And your notes if you tried this yourselves. And I shall see you guys in the next one. Bye bye for now.